Yeah. It's all welcome. started really on your YouTube channel, um, and uh, and and you you said that you're having trouble dating. Why? In what way? Um, various reasons. Number one, obviously, I'm a very attractive woman. Number two, I look very young. Number three, I'm very fun and I'm not your typical 44-year-old woman of four children. Uh -huh. So I'm finding that younger guys are messaging me, wanting to take me out, but they just want me because I'm hot. And then the older guys don't put any effort into themselves, but yet they want me to send them pictures of me looking good and they want to look at my body. And then they say, OK, I'll go out with you. But even if they don't, they still want to go out with me because I look young for my age. And what do your children say about this? Because, you, like you said, you've got four children. You've got 24-year-old, 22-year-old and 18-year-old twins. So they're, they're adult children. Yeah. Um, how, do, how do they feel about having a hot mum? Um, well, they've had it all their life, obviously, I'm not one to say, but um, they feel like I need to maybe lower my standards right. and find someone that is the similar age as me and just settle down and before they put me in a nursing home. But I'm saying no, because I have the advantage of looking good. So I want someone that I'm really attractive to, really connect with emotionally and want to enjoy my second part of my life. Mm. So I'm not just going to settle because I'm 44 and I'm not being married. Have, there, have any of their friends tried it on with you in the past? Yep. Oh, really? <laughs> I don't shout it from the rooftops, but they say, oh, do you want to go shopping? Do you need anything? I can pick your mum up from work. So they're not kind of straightly saying, I want to date your mum or your mum's hot, but their undertone is, wow, let me see if I can get in there and go and take her shopping or something. Your previous partner said you should come with a warning sign. <laughs> Stay clear. Yes. In what way? What, what's the reason? Why, why because should I don't take rubbish. Sign? Yeah. I don't take rubbish. So if I feel un unhappy in a relationship, I'm going to say, I feel unhappy. We need to compromise. We need to personal development. We need to grow. Just because I'm of a certain age, it doesn't mean I want to be sitting home watching TV 24-7. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You so wanna, I need you excitement. Live yeah. it's a, it, 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 a, a, being in a relationship and, and dating, it's, it's not all about looks. It's about personality as, as well. I mean, you are a very confident woman. There is no question about that. It is going to be intimidating and I've got to say, really rather unattractive for a, a man to hear almost say, you know, to be that confident. I am, I am gorgeous, I am hot, I am too good for you. Um, that, maybe that's why you're single. No, I don't go and say I'm too good for you, but if I can see there can be some way to help themselves, whether it be health-wise, financially, anything in life, then I would be there to support them. But what I don't agree with is a guy that maybe could lose a few pounds, could do some exercise, could lead a healthier lifestyle and not do it because they've got They must be out there, though. There are loads of guys like that out there. Yeah, but maybe I'm not attracting those type of guys. So, so, what, is, so what is the, the perfect man, then? What, what are you holding out for? I, I'm not looking for Mr. Perfect where I think everyone's got this slightly wrong. No one's perfect. I'm not perfect. I'm looking for a guy that is willing to work on himself and just understand what a woman's needs are. And, and my what are need, they? Well, I need everything. I need the full, the full package. I need to be stimulated in my mind. Every part of me needs to be feeling like a princess every day. Yeah. If that's wrong, then that's wrong. I'll stay on my own, I'll get a cat and I'll be happy. But I'm not going to live my life with someone that I'm not attracted to. I could get a rich man. I'm not in denial. I could get a rich man that's got a nice job. I'm not attracted to him and I could have a comfortable life. But money does not buy me happiness. Mm. Physical contact buys me happiness. A hug, embracing love buys me have happiness. Have you ever thought about changing the way you are slightly? Or is that, is that not even... I mean, because I just wondered whether you sort of think, well, maybe this isn't working for me to find somebody. Maybe I need, And all that confidence and thing is a wonderful thing. Lots of people are very unconfident in the world. But do you ever think, well, maybe I just should maybe tone that down a little bit or... I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know what you're saying, but then I would be false and I wouldn't be able to keep that up. This is what I am. This, I can't help it. Yeah. This is in my DNA. Fair enough. You, uh, I mean, you said that, um, that you know, if you can't find the guy here, then you go to America. Oh, God, I'll be off. I've got my passport. I'll be off around the world. I've had people from all around the world say, you know, if you were near, I would date you. Yeah. 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 I'm not be... going to just stick to the UK. If I can't find a man, I'll be mm. off. I will hunt for the rest of my life for my, for my soulmate. If I'm married at 96, yeah. let it be. be. Worth the wait. Terrible, yeah, yeah. terrible <laughs> curse to be so perfect and beautiful. Oh, it is. I know. <laughs> uh, thank well, you very sorry, much. What reaction do you normally get? I mean, do people sort of say, oh, come on, it's a bit big-headed of you to say things like that? Or do they... I mean, because you, you, I imagine you get lots of positive comments, but there must be those that react and oh, go... I've had I mean, I imagine terrible. if we look down on here, yeah, there'll be yeah. a lot of people yeah. going... 
Really? Well, I don't think we need to do that, but yeah, there are some horrible comments and I yeah. don't read them and I don't want my children to read no, them. No, fair enough. But at the end of the day, this is who I am. If people can um, relate to it, then fair enough. If they can't, they can't. Yeah. But this is how I choose to live my life. Well, good luck yeah. with it and no, thank you very absolutely. much. Yeah, I hope you nice, find your nice. perfect man soon. Yeah.